So I believe this is Elks Lodge number seven for us. And I think we're heading down to number eight today in Almagorda, New Mexico. So this is Roswell. <clears throat> and there's only one other camper. And this guy looks kind of permanent here. He's got a big load of wood. And the actual lodge is right there. And it's probably the nicest lodge on the inside that we've been to. They don't allow smoking there. Um, 50 amp service, water and they have a dumping station and the charge here is twenty dollars a night and it's pretty well located for the things that you want to do downtown check out all the alien oriented tourist traps and whatnot <clears throat> there's a lot of room for our dog to kind of run around and this part's fenced in we saw him doing some exercises over there yesterday so i don't know if that's military or what So, Dougie. So, Dougie. <laughs> yes, my dear. How are you? Oh, I've been better. I've come down with a cold. Yes. Second cold since we left. It's not good. No. And it happened when we were in Carlsbad Caverns. Yeah, I'll have to stop too. So. so, I wonder if it was had something to do with all that bat poop and dust and everything down there. Yep. Very possibly could. I started feeling sick that day. Yep. And last night he had a fever and chills, chills like crazy. <laughs> yep. Achy. And then it seemed like the fever broke in the middle of the night. Either that or the meds kicked in. Or the meds kicked in. But he's not really feeling himself today, so. Oh no. So where are we headed? Almagorda, New Al Mexico. Magorda. To the Elks Lodge. To the Elks Lodge. Is this and the one that has the indoor pool? This is the one that has the indoor pool. Oh. Yep. Yeah. Hopefully it's working. <laughs> so we shall see. So I just wanted to show you where we are. Here's Roswell. Right here. We are taking, we are currently on this 70 and 380. And in Hondo, we're going to be splitting off a of 380. And taking 70 which goes through some of the mountains here. Sorry. And we're going to end up in Almagorda. So the truck is working really hard because we are going up some hills here. Yep. Mountains, practically. But look at, I don't know if you can see way ahead of us, the snow-covered peaks. There's one over there. It must be over 10,000 feet high. Yeah, one of them, I don't know. I can't really tell which one yet. But there are some that are Capitan Peak is 10,083 feet. I don't know if you guys can see how it's changing here. It's pretty flat to all of a sudden it's pretty, pretty hilly, pretty mountainous. Yeah. It's actually very pretty. It's brown, but it's pretty. We just entered the town of Hondo. Bear left. Right? Correct? That's what they tell me. Look at this. <laughs> Those are cool. Metal art. No, Christina. You don't need any. Keep going. Even in New Mexico, they have Franken pines. Look at that. That's not a real tree. <laughs> We are in Rizzuto, I think is how you pronounce it, and it's a pretty neat town. Very nice. Yeah, they've got a lot of uh, stores here, a lot of pine trees. trees, like, yeah. <laughs> and look at the mountain with the snow right back there. Best Western, look at the entrance of that Best Western, it's like a castle. Got a lot of RV resorts here too. Look at this one. Cherokee Mobile Village. The old truck camper combo. That's cool. Oh, that's neat. So this is quite a place. It's on the Indian Reservation. 
Casino Apache Travel Center. So, big gas station, casino, huge thing for diesel. Now you'd think the diesel would be quite a bit cheaper here being on the res, but it's not that cheap. Two fifty-five. But we need some, don't we, hun? Pump her up! Just wanted to show you folks up north that we are subjecting ourselves to a little bit of snow. <laughs> It's 39 degrees here. We were just saying if we were back home, this would be a really nice day. Yeah, it was. It's sunny. The sun is really, the really so warm. Blue in this part of the country. Yeah, it's a pretty part of the New Mexico. Yeah, it is. Almost like New Hampshire. It's because it's more like. So this mountain pass had a warning on it. No trucks over 65 feet. So I got a feeling. The grades are going to get really steep, and it looks like you've got a lot of switchbacks here. Apache Summit, so you're uh, 7,600 feet high here right now, and it looks like we might be going down. So we're coming up on this spot, you see this big mountain with a cross on top. Oh, is. Is it clouds? Are we above the clouds? I have no idea. Well, look it up here. <laughs> It looks like we're above the clouds. Really? That's what it looks like to me. Those look like clouds. I don't know. Not like anything I've ever seen before. I guess we'll know when we get closer to it. So you're right in the mountains, coming down that mountain. And then you see all this white. And we're thinking, it must be the white sand. But from up there on top of the mountain, it looks like either clouds or snow. You can't see it at all now. The mystery will be solved soon. Yeah. It will be. So, Christina. So, Douglas. Where are you headed there, baby? To that thing right there. Is that the world's largest pistachio? The world's largest pistachio. Stay tuned, folks. We'll get a closer view. What were you saying? It looks like it's pistachio trees and a vineyard. This is a winery. Ah, begins. That thing is pretty big. Go next to it so we can see the scale of it. <laughs> that is very neat. You know, when you're traveling around like this, you always got to check out the world's largest whatever it is. <laughs> the roadside attractions. Talk about an attraction over here. We're still seeing these white sands in the it's the weirdest looking thing. way off at the base of these mountains. Christina, you could have parked right here. Well, being that you were driving, I probably could have. Yeah, <laughs> yeah the, we're parked out there because you see this wire it looked kind of low. Mm -hmm. We weren't sure if we'd fit under that, so we didn't really want to take For a the chance. Road Yep. And that, my friends, is too big. <laughs> yeah, that's a Road lot Runners bigger than the real happy. thing. Yep. She's going to go in and do a little gambling. Well, howdy, and welcome to Pistachio Land, USA, home of the world's largest pistachio. It's Are y'all pistachioed out yet? Uh, no. Look at all the samples. <laughs> the ice cream pecan, brittle, every kind of pistachio you can imagine. <clears throat> Meat store. Really nice store. McGinn's Pistachios. That must be the founder. It's a good sized place. The old Ford. Place is really clean. Bolin's Running Indian. <laughs> it's a big sign. Yeah. Very cool. Look how beautiful it is here.
So I think we hit the uh, jackpot with this Elks Lodge. Look at the view of the mountains. Oh my God. So you got the mountains over here and the white sands over on this side. Yeah. Our camper is probably the highest we've ever seen the auto level raise it <laughs> on one side. So we ended up putting boards underneath it, lowering it down a little bit, take the pressure off the uh, jacks. Kind of crazy. It looks more level than this, but I guess it's not because that auto level is usually pretty accurate. driving along on this really straight flat road and all of a sudden you start seeing like sand dunes here we are at the National Monument the dune area is straight White Sands. Very beautiful. Very white. So we're on the boardwalk at White Sands National Park. I'm lovely Mr. Mitchell, who's not himself at all today, but he's being a good Who sport. Who am I? Ooh, look, honey. Ooh, I'm glad Go I'm up here. snake. Now you know I'm up here. <laughs> we're walking on the boardwalk to... Uh... To where? <laughs> we don't know where. We're just walking. Mint. <laughs> yeah, it's 
pretty here. It's a little snow today. It's all right. You're moving. That's all that counts. So here we are, walking up the dunes. Park over here. Walk up on top. Check it out. <laughs> She's doing her sand angel, folks. <laughs> oh, that's beautiful, honey. Now let's see if I can, can you help me up? No. Oh, help me up so I don't ruin it. <laughs> yes, that is one beautiful smell. You were gonna think somebody had a stroke there or something. <laughs> so, Mr. Mitchell, tell me, yes, what, dear. tell me what you think about this place so far. It's different. Yeah. Different than anything else I've seen. Yes, we're I getting agree. quite a variety of national parks and national monuments. We are. This, this one's a national monument. A monument. Yep. I wonder what the difference of a monument versus a park is. I don't know. Hmm, I have price? to check that out. <laughs> With a pass, they're all free. Love it. Yeah, that's been working out great. Right? Mm -hmm. It has. I don't know if you'll see this or not, but if you look way over there, over there is the area that we came from, the mountains that had snow. Mm -hmm. So that is heading like north east and if you see all the beautiful mountains over here there's no snow they're a lot lower and there are mountains all around us they are gorgeous but they're not high like that one way over with the snow so all of a sudden the road turns to sand <laughs> Yep. If you're enjoying the videos, folks, please like, share, but most importantly, subscribe. 
You'd be amazed what you'll see if you get off the couch. Have a great day.